Hello, my dear. Today I am discuss about the array related conceptual question actually. Okay. So basically, we will show now that what is it? It is the collection of homogeneous data type. Okay. So my question is actually, if declaration of an array has n dimension, n dimension where n equal to three, and rest of the code in programming we are using m dimension where m less than n okay that means uh, m value either 0 1 2 not 3 okay that means we are working on elements okay so true or false if false what is the correct answer okay so this is actually a related conceptual question in this question actually to now that uh, how to actually working on array okay and fundamental theorem or concept of the array okay we also know that dimension means Dimension means a two equal to int eight equal to one two. Okay. Basically, this is the syntax of array. Syntax means at first data type. Okay. Then array name. Okay. Then size and value. <coughs> okay. So now. So now. My question is actually n dimension okay where n is 3 so that means in this case dimension means a2 so that means one dimension this is the one dimension okay if 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 there have a a2 and 1 that means this is the two dimension okay this is the two dimension and three dimension means three dimension means this okay now my question is and rest of the code in programming we are using if if we are using uh, rest of the programming where m is less than n okay so this is the initialize part this is the actually initialize part this is the actually initialize part and rest of the programming we just use uh, less than n that means we cannot use three dimensional we just use two dimensional like edge two one like edge one dimensional like edge no any dimensional we cannot use so now actually my uh, question is we are working on element if initialize with three dimensional array if we initialize with three dimensional array and rest of the code we just use two dimensional array or one dimensional array or or zero dimensional array so that means we are working on uh, elements so this is the true or false actually this is the false fine right? we also know that we also know that if initialize array and rest of the programming we actually working on initialize array same edge uh, same edge in, um, initialize array so that means we are working on element otherwise we are working on address okay so basic fundamental thing is if we use in the initialize a three dimensional and rest of the programming we use same dimensional that means three so same dimensional means we are working on element okay if same dimensional so that means same dimensional if so that means we are working on element working on element otherwise otherwise Dimensional is less than actually initial idea, so that means we are working on address. Working on address. So now, now my initial is three dimensional, and rest of the code just I am in I am just working on a two dimensional array or one dimensional. That means we are working on address. So my question is false, and if false, what is the correct answer? So address is the correct answer. So address is the correct answer. So this type of question actually will be asked on gate or any competitive exam. So I hope that you can understand just basic fundamental theorem. If we initialize array which dimensional, if we initialize array with n dimensional and rest of the code we just in, uh, just declare n dimensional that means we are working on element. Otherwise, otherwise we can initialize uh, dimensional which actually less than initialize array. Okay, initialize dimensional that means we are working on address okay 
if so this is the most important note just uh, note it okay if dimensional in, uh, initialized dimensional is greater than code dimensional code actually taken rest of the code rest of the code a uh, declaration declaration dimensional dimensional if initialized dimensional is greater than rest of the code the declaration dimensional that means we are working on that means this is actually address this is actually address okay and if same if equal that means we are working on element that means we are working on element okay so thank you for a bit